Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Holly Sweets Famous Southern Pudding Cakes. This is the lemon cake and it says it's ready to serve. I've already taken it out of the box. I took a picture of uh, what it looks like when you open the box. It's in plastic wrap. You, you remove it from the freezer. That's where you find these is in the freezer section at Walmart. When you're ready to serve it, you remove it from the freezer for one hour and then you heat it in the microwave for 30 seconds. This was $4.98 at Walmart. It's a pretty good it's, size cake too. It says in 1996, the Holly family baked their first pudding cake in my granny Holly's kitchen on a small farm in Southeast Alabama. <laughs> from those humble beginnings, we are proud to share our family tradition with your family. Working with local grocery stores, we have grown one customer at a time and we hope that you will take a cake home today for your weekend gathering, family celebration, or just a special treat. We would love for you to share your thoughts and stories with us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or Pinterest. Dawn Holly. Well, I did share a pic picture on um, Facebook and Instagram and Twitter because I took a picture of these. They, they were new to our Walmart. We had never seen them. And Ashley loves lemon cake. So I thought I would get this one and I got another one we're going to be trying. It says uh, there are supposed to be, you're supposed to get 12 slices. Do you want to cut it or do you want me to? I can't. I'm just going to... I'm not gonna be fancy. It says you're supposed to get 12 slices, one slice or 57 grams, you would have to weigh it if you cared, is 180 calories, and these are made in Samson, Alabama. Wait, how many servings are there? 12. Now, well, I'm cutting much smaller than 12. But you know what? The slices you're cutting are plenty big enough. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that looks, it smells really, really it good. Does. So all we did was we took the, the plastic wrap off of it. And it comes with a, um, like a, cardboard. a cardboard piece at the bottom. And so it looks, it looks like a pound cake. It does look like, it looks just like a pound cake. Okay. I'm going to try an inside piece that doesn't have any inside? glaze first. Okay. That's just me. I'm not used to the name pudding cake. It's probably more like a pudding cake. I mean, so the I didn't know the, what to pudding expect. Pudding in the mix, whatever kind of cake. That's a super moist cake. That tastes very good. Very, and very fresh. And it's got a little warmth to it where I microwaved it. Um, I yeah, like that. Now I'm going to try the top where the glaze is. Mmm. I love that. I like it both ways. That's delicious. Yep, you really, you don't need the glaze necessarily. But the glaze does add a, a lot of sweetness to it. And the glaze has that, um, mm. because it is a glaze, it <laughs> it is, you know, they poured it over there and it is set. So it has that sugary crispness, crispness yeah. to it. Um, Get that little graininess from the sugar crystals. Yes, crystal. that is, I love that. That is really, really good. And I think that when Miss Ashley gets home and oh, tries yeah, this. Oh, like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, this is my afternoon snack right mm -hmm. She <laughs> is going to love this. So, mm, I'm good. very impressed with this. How many calories is it for a slice? It's only 180. I don't think that's oh, bad. Oh, that's not bad. And you're supposed to get 12 slices. It's $5. $5 yeah. for, for all of this. And I think that's that's huge. And I, what I do like about it is the lemon. It's more, it's not like, a, it's a fresh lemon, but it's not a tart lemon. It's a mm -hmm. very sweet lemon. Mm -hmm. um, like they've just taken the sweetness from the lemon and put it in there. Uh, it's not Very cleaner, right. it's not chemically. Um, all the complaints we usually have about lemon, it's yes. none of those things. It's a they very, did a good job with that. very, very fresh flavor. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's really, really good and very moist. The cake, I know some people hate the word moist, but that's the best way to describe it. It's a very moist cake. It is. Um, it's, it's very, it's moist, but it's not wet. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. It's, it's good and, and tender. The texture is really good. I mm -hmm. mean, it's overall an excellent cake. So Very they did good. a really good job on it. Yes, they did. I would highly recommend you if you had a gathering, like on a weekend, you're going to cook out or have fried chicken or whatever. Um, this would be a really good thing to have with it. Don't and you I think? Just, yes, the only thing that I didn't say is you can enjoy it for up to 14 days after after, you've taken it. after you've taken it from the freezer. So even though we've heated it up, you can enjoy it for 14 additional days. And it doesn't say anything about putting it back in the refrigerator or anything. So what no. we'll probably do is just put plastic wrap over right. top of it. and keep it out. Yeah. And the date on the box 
if you put this in the freezer, it's good for a year from now. Yeah. A year. So yeah, if good. you buy it now, you could buy it even if you don't have a gathering right now. You might know of one in the future. You could grab one for five bucks, keep it in the freezer, and it's going to be good for a year. Yeah. So, so I won't have any problems buying one of these for any kind of any kind family of gathering. gathering where yeah. you want to get it a quick dessert that's nice and it's this delicious cool. yeah so i hope you enjoyed the video i'll have those pictures for you at the end and thanks for watching